Hi, I'm Martin. I'm the head of sales at ABB Traction Division. Today we are talking about how we as an ABB can accelerate and boost electrification in the mines. Hi, Antti. Hi, Martin. My name is Antti martin Lowry, and I'm, I work as, uh, in the ABB in the motors division, making motors for traction and e-mobility applications. And I fully agree that we have a super important topic of talking on electrification of mines here today. Absolutely. So now the question is where to start. It's a, it's a huge topic. So how do you see the situation right now? So yes, we all acknowledge the importance of, uh, of reducing uh, greenhouse emissions globally. But what is driving really now the, the electrification of mining is the total cost of ownership, which has become a, a ma major topic because of the rising energy prices and, and cost of operating the mines. So mining itself accounts 4 to 7 percent of the global emissions in the world and in mining industry 30 to 50 percent of the emissions comes from transportation of goods, uh, materials inside the mines. So uh, operators are becoming to recognize how can they reduce their cost of operating their mines. It's all about to, to shift from fossil fuels to alternative solutions. So how you see that? Uh, the electrification is, is the best way of reducing your cost of operations today. The technology is ready today and we have a very good examples that we have both worked at in, in electrifying the mines. Um, uh, let me give some perspective on what we are talking about. Uh, in, a, in a mine we have these massive big trucks that can consume let's say 130 liters of diesel per hour per one truck. And, and if you think about the global fleet of mining trucks there is around 28,000 of them operating uh, almost non-stop to even today. And that's a massive, uh, massive cost for the operators and at the same time a massive emission source. Uh, so, so when we as an ABB, what we can offer is to offer electrifying those, uh, those vehicles with a combination of batteries, overhead power solutions and uh, fully electric powertrains. I mean, we as an ABB are actually the only company who are able to offer the entire portfolio, you know, starting with the electrification products. And now our new, our new business here talking about uh, electrical drivetrains for, for, this huge, for this huge dump truck. Besides uh, the fuel expenses, uh, I also believe in terms of maintenance, it will be much easier. I think that's what we all see of us now in this market for, for electrical cars, where all of a sudden, you know, you don't need to do so much maintenance work uh, with the cars. I mean, uh, as a matter of fact, electrical drivetrain is much easier to maintain than if you would talk about uh, a, a diesel-driven uh, traction chain. Correct. There is a lot less components and, and maintenance needs. Typically, uh, another 20% reduction in maintenance is possible. But I think also worth highlighting is the efficiency of, of powertrains. Even the best diesel engines have a conversion efficiency of 45%, whereas an electrical motor is typically up to 95% efficient in converting energy into, into movement. And that is a significant difference in, in technology-wise. Um, but, but Martin, how does the customers um, see these values? So uh, how are customers reacting and, uh, from your perspective uh, on, on our uh, offering? I really would want to tell you from a fantastic business case in, in, in these mines. Uh, I really need to say if I'm telling my friends, you know, uh, that we have such a kind of a project. Um, as you know there, you know, we're taking the goods, the mine, it's in the cement industry, they take the goods from the top hill, you know, and then they're driving downwards uh, 300 meters. And I mean, the business case is really just fantastic uh, that, you know, the, the fully loaded dump truck, you know, 160 tons loaded. So he's driving down to the port. It's a very, very steep slope. I, I was driving myself together, of course, not myself, but with the driver. And then by going downwards, you know, we are going to recuperate the energy. And then he's going to unload the truck. And then with the fully charged battery, he can go back on top hill, you know, and take uh, the, next, uh, the next amount of goods to bring down again. It's like free energy when, when, yeah, you, when you are transporting goods downhill. Absolutely. I mean, of course, that's a very sp special business case. But as a matter of fact, there they really they get rid of any kind of external energy sources. I think mining is an industry that plays a vital role in the world. And, and um, collectively, as the world moves into the, uh, towards the zero emission uh, vision, that um, we have to help the operators becoming more efficient. Uh, before we end, I think it would be worthwhile mentioning that uh, the fossil fuel industry, uh, sorry, the fossil fuel transportation of people, goods and materials 
um, basically accounts 25% of the total energy consumption in the world. So mining is only one part of it and I think we will be happy to talk about the other industries in, in future, future segments as well. Absolutely. I think mining is now a starting point, but we are very, very keen also to enter into other, into other segments. And uh, I think it's just fantastic, really, that we find here such a close cooperation. So I think really just together we can, we can design the most efficient drivetrain there is all the time. It is a pair, you know, motor and drives uh, belong together. And then on top of that, with the most efficient and powerful battery. And I think then we have a really strong package that we can bring together to the market. Mm -hmm.